says climate change is threatening their very survival here. There were 7,000 moose living in New Hampshire when Christine Rhines became Fish and Game's first moose expert. 35 years later, the herd is less than half that and shrinking. As a moose biologist, it makes me very sad. The culprit, the winter tick that used to die off in winter. As our winters have gotten shorter, which is caused by climate change, it's giving ticks a huge advantage. Not only are they killing large numbers of calves, but they're reducing the ability of cows to have calves. The mortality rate is rising. Over 50% of moose calves dying each year from anemia and protein deficiencies in four of the last five years. And those calves, they only need about 35,000 ticks on them to die, and we've counted upwards of 90,000. She fears the New Hampshire moose could disappear. There are a lot of diseases and ectoparasites that are coming our way that they did not evolve with. In addition, they, they are this northern based species. They're used to colder, cooler conditions. We don't know how heat itself is going to impact them over the long term. Moose aren't the only 